Just waiting for the kids to come out to go to school, but I just wanted to do a quick video I thought about it, about banking in the Philippines. Um, one of the things I've seen, somebody lost about a quarter of a million pesos doing, is they opened a bank account and put a initial deposit of a quarter of a million pesos into the account. Now, with the Philippines, you pick up your PIN number and your bank card at the bank. You sign for them. So basically, you can get the PIN number and the bank card in the bank at the same time. The problem with that is, is like he found out, they delayed him receiving the PIN and card for a month uh, because somebody in the bank was actually stealing the money. They stole the quarter million. And when they finally said, oh, well, you know, what's going on? He said, well, you've already signed for it. You already had your bank card. We gave you a month ago. The bank had actually stolen the money. When I say bank, I don't mean bank as in the company. I mean bank as an employee at the bank. But there is no way that bank would turn around and say that an employee in the bank had actually stolen the money, even if they were going to sack them. So it is something to be aware of. Just put the initial 5,000 pesos or whatever it is that you need in the bank, and nothing more. Not until your bank uh, PIN card and the yeah your bank card and your PIN are back with you. Um, the other thing is, rural banks are easier to open, but they often don't have international transfers. So I advise sticking with the big big banks like the BDO and maybe HSBC. All right, thanks for watching.